seventeen camels and three sons. Long ago, there lived an old man with his three sons in a deserted village, located in the vicinity of a desert. He had seventeen camels, and they were the main source of his income. He used to rent out camels as a means of shipping in the desert. One day, he passed away. He had left a will, leaving his assets for his three sons. After the funeral and the other obligations were over, the three sons read the will. While their father had divided all the property he had into three equal parts, he had divided the seventeen camels in a different way. They were not shared equally among the three as seventeen is an odd number and a prime number, which cannot be divided. The old man had stated that the eldest son will own half of the seventeen camels, the middle one will get one third of the seventeen camels, and the youngest one will get his share of camels as one ninth. All of them were stunned to read the will and questioned each other how to divide the seventeen camels as mentioned in the will. It is not possible to divide seventeen camels and give half of the seventeen camels to the eldest one. It is not possible also to divide the camels for the other two sons. They spent several days thinking of ways to divide the camels as mentioned in the will, but none could find the answer. They finally took the issue to the wise man in their village. The wise man heard the problem and instantly found a solution. He asked him to bring all the seventeen camels to him. The sons brought the camels to the wise man's place. The wise man added a camel owned by him and made the total number of camels eighteen. Now, he asked the first son to read the will. As per the will, the eldest son got half the camels, which now counted to eighteen halves equals nine camels. The eldest one got nine camels as his share. The remaining camels were nine. The wise man asked the second son to read the will. He was assigned one third of the total camels. It came to eighteen thirds equals six camels. The second son got six camels as his share. Total number of camels shared by the elder sons nine plus six equals fifteen camels. The third son read out his share of camels, one ninth of the total number of camels eighteen ninths equals two camels. The youngest one got two camels as his share. Totally there were nine plus six plus two camels shared by the brothers, which counted to seventeen camels. Now, the one camel added by the wise man was taken back. The wise man solved this problem smartly with his intelligence. Intelligence is nothing but finding a common ground to solve an issue. In short, every problem has a solution.